We gather today in this beautiful setting, Arrowhead Pine Rose Forest, to celebrate the love that Trevor and Caitlin have found with each other. The day you have chosen to affirm your love for each other with spoken words and feelings. The best love is the kind that awakens the soul and makes us reach for more, that plants a fire in your hearts and brings peace to your mind. You have found that in each other. Love is a constant process of tuning in and connecting, reading and misreading cues, disconnecting, repairing and finding deeper connection. It's a dance of meeting, parting, and finding each other again, minute to minute and day to day. You're a picture and every piece seems to fall into As I look at them today sitting side by side, it's clear that they have found not just love, but true partnership. A love that lifts each other up, embraces the quirks, and even finds joy in all the small, silly moments. Trevor compliments Caitlin in every way, and together they bring out the best in each other. This love is the best. Maybe once in a lifetime, you find someone who not only touches your heart, but also your soul. Someone who loves you for who you are and not what you could be. Maybe the art of true love is not about finding the perfect person, but about seeing an imperfect person perfectly. You're the best thing I, I love you. For my whole life, I have been dreaming about this day. Like most little girls, we dream of the man that we will someday marry. I vow to always be there when you need me, to support you through everything, and always be your cohort and baseball partner. We both went through times where we felt neglected, unloved, and unworthy. I vow to you that you will never feel that way as long as we are on this journey together. One of my favorite things is about how much I can make you laugh. <laughs> After long days, I can always be myself around you, and hearing your laughter has become one of my greatest joys. Thank you for bringing love back into my life. You have taught me how to love myself again. Still getting there. And for that, I am grateful. Thank you for making me laugh so uncontrollably that I sound like Dastardly Dog and Wheezy. <laughs> I promise to always be open and honest, to communicate no matter what, and to keep making you laugh. The past three years have been the best of my life. After losing my father, I felt a void. I lost a love that was enduring, graceful, and full. I lost a love that was supposed to last a lifetime, and I never thought I would find that love again. We are in ocean, a gentle power that could never be contained. Moving softly, like the rain that falls and dances on the plain. To the two of you, May your whole new world together be as magical as Cinderella's ball, adventurous as Rapunzel's tower escape, and as romantic as the Lady and the Tramp spaghetti dinner. You guys have what it takes. You are strong enough. You are brave enough. You are capable. You are enough. You are worthy. So it's time to stop thinking otherwise and start believing in yourselves as a couple together. Because no one else has the dreams that you guys have. 
No one sees the world exactly like you do, and no one else holds the same magic inside. Thank you for all being here tonight and being able to celebrate with Katie and Trevor. Like I said, it means the absolute world to them. This, these, you are their favorite people. And um, enjoy the night. to Miss Cora. I vow to treat you and love you as my own. I vow to protect you and cherish you and be your biggest supporter. I promise to nurture our relationship and I promise to listen. I can't wait to be present for your life and watch you grow up. Your father and I love you very, very much. <laughs>